welcome back to the UK Brick Builder channel. Um, as you know, if you follow my channel, uh, I do a fair few reviews and I also do some mocks. Um, what I'm going to show you today is sort of a bit of a planning stage of my next mock. So, what I did was build myself a mills plate, um, marked out my six wide street. Um, because it's out on a mills plate, I will end up changing these few squares for a, a more suitable colour for underneath the drains. Uh, but for now, this is purely in the in the planning stages um, I've worked out a rough layout um, the whole idea is that this ground floor is going to be one entity um, and then this section across the back here will almost in theory be split into two um, the idea being that I will have a stud one won't end up there so the door will open outwards but a doorway there and same with that one that one will end up going I've just grabbed a couple that I've got just for planning um, and we'll then end up with another door there which is like a rear door to the the main part of the the build uh, so obviously that will have an adjoining door into um, but then what I was going to do is a little sort of entrance hall to the stairs to go up to the second floor um, again like I say this is all in the in the planning um, and likewise double width front door um, let's find a way to finish those off how I how I want um, but as I have said before and probably the keen eyed of you will notice that the whole idea with some of my hauls before is that I have bought loads of items that I can use in different builds um, you know, obviously this one is in the in the planning stage at the moment but just to perhaps not give too much away but, uh, a little bit maybe this is something along the lines of what I was thinking of doing uh, that might give you some idea as to to what this final ground floor build is going to be um, I shall end up with a corner pillar here um, might do a little feature panel that side um, I was thinking, because I've got quite a few of them, maybe something along the lines of this, but what I thought I might try just to make it a little bit different, because now I know that they stack quite nicely. Is I thought I might try and see if uh, no, it's not going to work. I might have to look at a slightly different. I was thinking of perhaps putting sort of items in there to make them look like a display in the window. Um, 
I might have to go down the route of actually using like the clear version of one of those because then once I've done that I can stack it up with these and that gives the idea of something in the display um, that's my thinking maybe even one here and a double on that side so it all mirrors but I'm not 100% certain yet like I say we're still in the planning stage um, I do have some of these window panes with stickers on um, if it doesn't really show that well until you get it in the right light but uh, that one's got cracks on it uh, now I won't be using that in this build but uh, just think that I, I've never taken the stickers off because you know I might find a use for it in a in a fun fun build way maybe later on um, some double doors and if I can find the one by ones that I was looking for I might just give away whole idea for what I'm going to be doing um, uh, I wonder if that's it yep so I'm going to put that down as one door handle another just for now I may end up doing in fact I'll probably do that now make them match so there that probably gives it away uh, I have been collecting loads and loads and loads of pieces to allow me to make a food shop, supermarket, that sort of thing. Somewhere in my Lego city where my figures can go get their lunch, their dinner, a pineapple maybe. You know, I've got a Selection of baguettes, carrots, things like these posters. I might even just do something like that down that wall. Uh, I've got tiles with strawberries on, rolls of sushi. So I should probably not get more of this over the time. And what I was thinking of doing was probably some shelving down this wall a couple of like fridge units or free like chiller units um, maybe some slightly deeper fridge freezer units and shelving above them and then a couple of rows of shelving and a sort of a till counter in this area just so that it all feels shop like um, I was thinking and again like I say still in the planning stage if I can find 
one of the new six wide double door frames in black then this will be changed and the door frame narrow to a six because I like the idea of not having the bar down the middle um, but again like I say this is all a work in progress at the moment um, very much still in the in the planning stage but I just thought I would do a quick video to introduce you all to my next project uh, and give you an idea of where I am going with some of the channel projects um, and just touch base with people so they can see that uh, although I've been doing review videos recently I haven't been sitting on my laurels doing anything doing nothing um, mock building takes a lot of planning I mean I am far from an expert builder so this has taken me about two weeks of laying down pulling apart trying different windows different pillar ideas different layouts to come out with something that I am happy with and think will look good in my city um, I think this outside wall here will end up because I'm going to put shelving behind it it will probably end up with the panel versions of these the fully enclosed panel versions of these probably with like graffiti stickers or odd things like that on them just so as that if I, could, I sit it next to a, another building it won't matter or if I put it next to a building that's got an alleyway it will still show um, but uh, yeah all of this has been designed with standard modular dimensions in place uh, and this is something that I'll be focusing on and showing more in the next few videos so if you want to see those then please like comment um, share subscribe and come back for the next video.